As in all beginnings of any painting, it's all going to be initially about getting correct proportion. If we rush too fast to go to the painting stage without getting proportion first, then it doesn't matter how good your colours are, it's still not going to be as good a painting as it could be. Let's, let's see about getting started. I've already made a little start on the canvas. I've, as you can see, I've got four points. I've got the furthest left, right, the furthest left, the bottom, which actually represents uh, the bottom of the um, cotton reel, and this here, which represents right at the top. My very first mark is going to be where the top is, where the absolute top of this um, bottle is here. Now, once you've got the height in, or the size in, then obviously you then have the width, which gives you proportion. If your width is too small, it's going to be out of proportion. If your width is too wide, it's going to be out of proportion. The interesting thing about a lemon, as you get into the dark shadows around this area, by making yellow dark or darker, it's very easy for it to go green. So we have to compensate for that as we uh, work our way through. These first marks are quite crucial to get right. I think we're happy with those. All I want in these early stages is the correct height, correct width, and correct uh, location of the canvas. Okay, so let's look at um, now adding some dark. So the raw umber and the French ultramarine blue mixed together will go pretty much a, a black, as you can see there. Put this in as a stain, very thin, not thick paint. We're not painting yet. Can you see what I mean by if you matched your lights and darks so they're all correct, the shapes, the values, you'd have an amazing painting. I mean, I've totally forgotten that these bottles are blue. You don't, you know, you can just, it could be yellow. It doesn't really matter. What matters is that you're capturing, well, the key thing is make sure you're having fun, because if you're not having fun, then I mean, that's the most important thing. But um, if you relax into it, if you're happy with it, then you'll get a better result. So don't stress. Anything which makes it easier for you to do something is good. I'm just going to pick a darker colour. Bit of the red. Bit of this black. Now the cadmium red light is an orangey red, which means there's quite a bit of yellow in it, if you think about it this way. If that was a lizarding crimson, there'd be no yellow in it at all. It wouldn't be an orangey red, it'd be a purpley red. So you could say there'd be a little bit of blue in the red. So I'm going to leave that brush as that colour. Now I'm going to go to a slightly uh, different brush for the next couple of colours. So the brush which I've just put down is the light and let's call it ultra light. Here it is. Now, let's look at the next colour in, which is this one here. Again, don't blend. Um, you want to keep it quite edgy. And it, it feels like we've, we've got some manoeuvrability here. We can, we can pop, pop it in and know that we can take it darker quite easily. Going to be, we need to be mindful of the fact, obviously, that I'll lose a crown of the blue. So I'm going to use almost a dry brush just to turn it and force that edge down. Keeping it away from the blue. So that edge, this dark 
area I just want to reduce slightly but I don't want to take it away so I'm kind of tackling it a little bit gingerly not thinking at all when I'm painting this I don't, uh, I don't think I'm painting a lemon for example totally oblivious as to what it is I'm only interested in seeing the shapes if you're painting and you're looking at the clock you're doing a nine to five you're X number of hours. Let's say you've got, you got 10 hours to make a painting, then obviously you don't want to be spending too much on each stage. But if you're learning, well, it doesn't matter if you take 10 hours or 50. It matters that you enjoy it. And so as I'm saying, it's nice that uh, this stage I really enjoy because it, it's a way of getting in and just having some fun.